Greetings, people of Warwick. My name's Sam, and I have a story to tell you. It's a story of how a ragtag bunch of peasants banded together to save our castle from attack. Now, some of you may say my story is a myth, a fable, a falsehood, but I say to you, the story that you are about to see is a legend. My friends, I give you the legend of the Trebuchet! Now, to those of us who lived and worked at the castle, the 22nd of April, 1470, started off as just another day. Folks were just going about their business as usual. See, over there, that's Thomas. He's a local farmer. Greetings, Thomas. Oh, and over there is Clem, who's one of the castle cooks. Good day, Clem. Hard stuff, Sam. I need turnips. And over there is Mel. Mel is also a farmer, but not like Thomas. Mel's a gong farmer. They look after the castle toilets. Greetings, Mel. Sam. I've lost me bucket. Have you seen me bucket? Is this your bucket? <gasps> yeah, that's it. Keep it away from my turnips. Sorry. And over there are the castle's magnificent minstrels. They like to come down to the river to practice. So, as I said, it was just a normal day until this happened. for the throne of England. How do you know they're Yorkists? They're flying the sun in splendour. Edward's banner. They're going to attack the castle. That's Harold. He's a great bowman. Yorkists! With a cannon. What are we going to do? Call out the guard! There is no guard. Our soldiers are on the other side of Warwick at the tournament field. The Earl and our soldiers are getting ready for a big tournament. I've already sent a message to the Earl. By the time the Earl gets back, those Yorkists will be in the castle. What are we going to do? Run away! We could have run away, but I had an idea. Oi! We need to keep the Yorkists at bay until the Earl gets back. How? We're going to unleash the bear. We haven't got a bear. There's the bear! That's right. I'm talking about Ursa. Ursa, Latin for bear. We'll shoot Ursa. Shoot Ursa? How are you going to do that? How are we going to do that? We? We're just servants. We don't know how to shoot a trebuchet. My grandfather helped build her. He taught me how to shoot her. But it was built for attacking castles, not defending them. Clem's right. But grandfather told me that the sight of a trebuchet will always strike fear into the enemy's heart. Not just because of her shooting power, but because of her size. I mean, look at her. She's huge. She stands 60 feet tall and weighs over 22 tons. Listen, if we shoot her, it'll give us a chance to keep the Yorkists at bay until the Earl gets back. Are you with me? No! I need all of you. But they've got a cannon. We need to defend the castle. If we don't, we'll lose our homes. Well, I don't want to lose me own. Nor do I. Look, I need all of you. Are you with me? Oh! Oh! And are you with me? Yeah. Then let's unleash Arthur, the Warwick Castle Trebuchet! Yeah. Yeah. Thomas, you are now the Trebuchet Master! Hey. Minstrels, you are the Winders! Yeah. You can't shoot a trebuchet without the Winders. They have to get in those wheels which my grandfather called squirrel wheels and bring the throwing arm down. It's a really hard job, but I know Thomas and our minstrels can do it. Defenders, ready! Born ready! ready. Well prepare the castle defences. Good plan, Harold. We need to work fast. Over the years, siege engines have got bigger. Because castles have got bigger, it can take 
months or years to defeat a castle. But if you've a trebuchet shooting massive rocks, you've got a good chance of smashing down the walls. Anyone defending a castle that sees a siege engine the size of Urza will lose heart and is more likely to surrender. That's the power of the trebuchet. They've only got the one cannon! But it's a big one! If anyone can sort out our defences, it's Harold. Now, now I, I need you to be strong. Yeah. You're fearless! I'm fearless? No, you're Those Yorkists, they've got spies out there. And I want those spies to see that we, the castle's first line of defense, we're fearless. What are we? Harold, can you distract that cannon? Aye. Harold comes from a long line of great bowmen. In fact, his grandfather fought at the Battle of Ashincourt. Try the one that's firing that cannon. It's over there. No, it's over there. No, it's over there. It's over there. All right, you two. Now, the commands for loosing arrows are... Knock. Knock. Draw. Draw. Loose. Loose. Right, with me. Knock. Knock. Draw. Loose. Loose. Good. Again, but louder. Knock. Knock. With that, this. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Are you ready to fire? 
to destroy their cannon and to save Warwick Castle. Are you ready to shoot Ursa? Yeah. Yes! Are you ready to shoot Ursa? Yes! We'll count down from ten, then we all shout loose. Ready? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Victorious in defending our castle. Give yourselves a huge cheer! 